Oh, didn't notice that. <clears throat> cool. Ready? Hi everybody and welcome to Dad Crafts. I'm here with my son James. Me. And we're gonna do a fun craft today. Um, we did this a few minutes ago, where where I where we made this stuff. And by the way, this one was not made from us. It was made from my friends Lincoln and Ethan. And I'm making this for them. It's basically it's art, a picture that you can make out of. Play-Doh Play or softy dough. Yeah, we're using softy or any, dough. Or any kind of dough. Or modeling clay or that kind of thing. Yeah, I like that. First thing you're going to need is a lot of you probably have CD clay cases laying around that you don't use anymore. Um, so, well, this one's broken, so let's see. This one's not. Nope. So, I'm going to put this aside because I have. we're going to have a craft for this later. Um, hey, we, we can maybe make cool glasses out of, of out of CDs. Yeah, there's all sorts of things we can do. Uh, this plastic, this black plastic right here is pretty easy to pop out. Just, you know, I've got a little spatula. It's not an actual spatula if you're looking. And also, this CD has rainbows on it. Oh yeah, we'll light it. So this comes out fairly easily. Um, I'm going to set that aside because I don't know, we'll think about it, but there might be something we can do with this for crafting stuff. Yeah, you got the back paper. If you want to leave that in for what we're doing, you can, uh, but we find it works better just to take it out. There, I'll just take that one all open now. Okay. okay. Uh, out. And also, we're going to be need this, needing this a little bit later. So don't keep looking at this if you're looking at that. Okay, well, why don't you show them what, what we're getting ready to do. What okay. Gonna we're going to do like this softy dough. We're going to take it out like that. Use this dough. This is a knife which has a mold on the back on the bottom. Said you can use play doh, you can use modeling clay. It doesn't, it it's doesn't, something you can do with your fingers. Yeah, like this stuff. I'm just gonna roll it up. And I kind of like the idea of a little sun that, the, that your friends did for you. And I think I'm gonna put the sun on the other side here. Yeah, it doesn't matter what side the sun's on, but kind of, I don't know really. Mm -hmm. I'm just a kid, I don't know everything in the world. Really? Yes. Okay. But I will know everything in the world <coughs> sooner when I'm older. Oh, that's good. The quest for knowledge. <laughs> and also geography. 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 Ge I'll, I'm also learning how to say words better. Yeah. Well, that's, that's what school's for. <coughs> so, let me see. How about... Some black. Sure. What are you making? I'm not sure yet. I'm just kind of winging it here. Just the yellow if you want yellow. I might use the white. 
light. Okay. I know what I'm going to use the light for now. You do? Mm-hmm. I'm going to use it for the clouds. Hmm. I'm going to need some light here soon, too. Why? I don't know, because I'm thinking we might make some penguins. Okay. Okay. So we probably need some orange as well. Okay, I'll get the orange in a second. some white in there too to give them that tuxedo look. Tuxedo, yeah. Well, they don't wear bow ties just in case you don't know a lot about penguins. Well, I know one penguin who wears a bow tie. His name is Opus. Yeah, the only penguin that wears a tie is Opus. Yeah. And also a few other penguins. Think so? Yep. Okay. Are, you, are, are one of these penguins, are one of those penguins going to be Opus? Uh, no, I don't think so. Not today. Maybe okay. another time we'll, we'll see if we can do a, an opus. Okay. Oh, I also have an opus book. It's called Good Night Opus. Yeah, that's a wonderful book. And also it's a Good Night Opus book. Yep. Yeah. Can I have a wipe? Sure. Right here is a lid. No lid. It, these are my clouds. Yeah. Like make some sky. Between the clouds. That's pretty neat. It doesn't have to be super fancy. I think I'm good there. And the other thing, I've got string, but some people use you can use ribbon, you can, you know, use uh, something other than plain old string, but that's what we happen to have around the house. And on these CD cases, I don't know if you can see it right here, all of them have these already built-in holes right here, which is pretty cool. So, you know, with the string, I'm having to put it the end, end down a little bit, but just it right right on through I think I think those holes are for their reason well I'm sure they designed them that way for a reason okay what else do I do oh yeah I need a boat need a boat a color boat what I have what other color we haven't used yet which color have we used? I don't know, but there's the white there's the lid have you used purple yet mm. what else? Maybe I could make a purple boat. A purple boat. With, a, with stars on it. With stars on it? Yeah, like this. So we'll get this threaded through here. Great. So it's threaded through. Look at this purple. Just tie the ends off however long you want to make it. This purple is cool. Look at it, everybody. Yeah. Purple's kind of a cool color. Just tie a little knot. <clears throat> and then shut it, and then that'll get it nice and tight. And then mush things down a little bit and get them settled. So I've got three big ones walking under the sun. Maybe you should make maybe you should make ice under them. I don't know. I think that's good for now. Yeah, I'm just I'm just asking. Yeah, I made this one for James earlier, so he can hang it. It's a little Valentine's pre, something to get ready for Valentine's Day. Just uh, I love you. Pretty simple. You can hang that in his room. And did you show him the one you did earlier? 
um, the one that I did earlier, I'm going to show it in a second after I make my okay. purple boat. Okay. Why don't you make your purple boat? Yeah. Is it a sailboat? Is it an aircraft carrier? What kind of boat is it? Mm, it's like their boat. Mm. Only a little bit smaller. It's going to be like a sailboat. Mm, with stars on it. Stars so it's on. showing it belongs to America. Yeah. Which color is this? I don't know. Is that the purple? purple maybe? Is it empty? That's the only thing that's empty? I guess. Okay. What color your star is going to be? Uh, they're already made. Oh, okay. Oh, they're mushed on there. Oh, oh, I see. I see. The blue thing in the middle here? Um, sky. Sky. And then you got ocean. Ocean. Boat. Purple with boat. With three stars. Three stars on it. You want to so show them what you did earlier? Just in case you don't know what this game is, I'll tell you what the game is. It's called Angry Birds. Yep. It's, so you got the slingshot. You got, you know, walking through what you got there. Okay, the slingshot. Sling. Why don't we do this? The slingshot is the thing where the, this bird will sling. Here's a different bird, and it's gonna hit the structure and kill the pigs, because that's the idea of the game. That's right. Also, it it doesn't show real killing animation. It just shows like pop five thousand. Yeah. Like that. So it's cartoon violence. It's a, it's a pretty safe game, so. Yeah. yeah, it's fun and it teaches you about structures and where the weak points are and that kind of thing, right? And also, there's other, a lot of, a lot of these other games. There's like Angry Birds Seasons, Angry Birds Transformers, Angry Birds Epic, Angry Birds Go, yeah. Angry Birds Friends, Angry Birds Space. I like I I don't think I've named them all right. Did you know Angry Birds Star Wars? Angry Birds Star Wars, Angry Birds Star Wars Two. There's a lot of Angry Birds games out there. A lot of Angry Birds games. If you're an Angry Birds fan, then you should get them if you don't have them. Yeah. Well, let's focus on what we're here for. Uh huh. Which is which is this fun little craft for folks to do. Okay. Mm -hmm. See those piglets? Yep. Yep. You should, I think you should put eyes on them. Well, yeah, maybe tiny, later. Tiny eyes with the light. <clears throat> we just want the folks to see the, the basics how to do it. Again, you don't necessarily have to use Play-Doh or <clears throat> Softy Doh, which we use. Um, except you can get creative with it, use your own imagination. Uh, open this up, I mean, you can use glue and, and tissue paper, color tissue paper. Uh, you can, you know, glue some pebbles in there. Uh, you know, there's, there's just all sorts of ways you can utilize this to make a, a picture that you can hang just whatever your particular talent is uh, so we you know we, we chose to do the the play-doh because it was easy uh, we were inspired by his friends who made this for him uh, so they did a great job on that and this actually still hangs in our house because uh, it's just a, a gift from their heart so it was a made from a long time ago yeah so but that's it for this episode of Dad Crafts. Uh, hope uh, hope you enjoyed the show. Uh, go ahead and subscribe. Leave some uh, comments and things you may want to see us try in the future. Yeah. And uh, thank you for watching. Appreciate it. Have a great day. Also, leave likes, please. And also, subscribe. Leave likes, comment. If you don't have a Google, if you don't have a Google account, make one right now so you can subscribe. And also leave a comment. And also like. And bye everybody.